Still talking politics, members of the All Progressives Congress in Koshafe Federal Constituency have thrown their weight behind the aspiration of Ashiwaji Bola Tinumbu to become the next president of Nigeria. The pledge they support during the inauguration of the Tinumbu support group in the area. Abin Bolag Baby reports. The crowd at the venue of the event speak volume about the purpose of this gathering. <laughs> It's the launch of the Tinubu Support Group by lawmaker representing Kushofe Federal Constituency at the National Assembly. They are here to draw more support for the national leader of the All Progressives Congress, Bola Tinubu, having declared his intention to join the 2023 presidential race earlier in the year. What we are doing today is to come together to appeal to Ashiwaju to continue to do what he's doing, that we are for him, that the people will support him. TSG is a group that was uh, inaugurated in the National Assembly and I brought it to my constituency, Koshofe Pedra constituency. Their weapon to fight is, the, is their cards. They should go and revalidate, they should go and get cards to wait and vote in 2023. Tinubu support group has been launched in different parts of the country and Lagos is not an exception. We Koshafe people, Koshafe constituency, we are strongly behind our father, our mentor, Bola Because we knew he's a performer, he's a developer, he's a human de uh, developer, and he can develop your Nigeria. Well, you can see for yourself that the turnout is massive. That is an indication that all Yoruba people are behind Ashwaju Bola Metunubu. And we hope uh, God will grant us our prayer. Yeah, because of our candidate, our the next president, uh, Ashwa Jubala Ahmed Tunubu. So this is how uh, our leader, Right Honorable, wrote to me, Abu Soye. He's the one that leads us to come here, then we are going to support. Then we don't have any party that is our Tunubu. Tunubu, Tunubu is our party. As followers and believers in the former Lagos State Governor's vision for Nigeria, they are confident of his capacity to lead the country. Abimbola Agbibi, CBC News, Lagos.